an Indianapolis neighborhood that has fought to rebuild itself. And because of a lot of hard work and dedicated neighbors, we can see definite signs of progress tonight. RDV 6s Jason Fechner spent his day on the east side. Good evening, everyone. Those living here in the Martindale Brightwood community say that they have faced their share of challenges from crime and poverty through the years. But now they're relying on each other and they're rebounding in a very big way. A lot of people uh, forget about this community and forget about the people. With the James Wilson never forgot Martindale Brightwood, but the neighborhood he'd called home had changed so much while he was away. Two years ago, after I came home from prison, I started this organization, kind of just taking a look in the community. I was kind of sad by what I seen. Well, now that I come home, they're saying one stand on the corner with the drugs and the guns and so on and so forth. And the realization is that we set that precedent. A lot of the older folks set that precedent. So we wanted to do something different. I wanted to give back. And he has, starting the group Circle Up Indy, getting Lowe's and volunteers on board this past fall to overhaul the Hope Christian Community Center. God. God is the best thing in this community going, and I think that he's going to make a change in it as we submit ourselves to him. Just across the street, an empty lot now set to be transformed into a new community garden by kids. Community leaders saw the plan for the first time Wednesday. And just down the street, Rhonda Oliver is getting set to move her library to a larger space simply to help more people. Moved to this area in 1972, and we're looking forward to having a new library uh, about 2017. Steady improvements, big changes, all because of one thing. The people. The people are the greatest asset. Everybody have issues. Everybody has struggles, but it's up to us to love them. It's up to us to treat them uh, and to show them something different. And if you'd like to get involved in this community's ongoing renaissance, we'll post the links to all the organizations behind it right now with this story through the RTV6 app. On the east side this evening, Jason Fechner, RTV6. Now your storm